Hey miners, Mining King here. Today I'm going to be showing you uh, how to, you know, how to fill up this motherboard I recommended to you before. This is the uh, ASRock H510BTC. I recommended this for all the new miners. So um, today we're going to be filling it up with some of the cards I recommended. There is six RX 6600s. These are the uh, light editions. So if you come, if you see here that they have these ports taped off, that is because there is no additional ports. So there's actually, the reason that it's called light is because it only has one, dis one display port and one HDMI. So the other two will be taped off as they didn't solder any additional ports. Other than that though, it's the exact same card as the regular uh, Pulse 6600. So I got these off of Amazon. I wanted to do this because I wanted to show miners how easy it is to actually, you know, work this board. Um, because when you're building a frame or you're building rigs, um, it can get kind of messy. You got a lot of cables. What we're going to do is, is, is I'm just going to show you how just to pretty much set this board up for graphics cards. It's as easy as just use make sure the butterfly's down. You line up the GPU, press in. Make sure all these are down, they're all down. Just line up the car, slot in, slot in, slot in. And now we'll take off the, uh, <laughs> try to take off this plastic. Alright, so we have our graphics cards in, we took all the plastic off, so the next thing we need to do is just, uh, in this instance here, I'm going to use some splitters because I'm using an 850 watt uh, ATX power supply, so we're just going to split each one of these cards, so all we got to do is just, because these cards only use, when I tested them, it only uses 63 watts per card these cables can handle roughly about 270 watts so we're well below that range so we are going to just plug them in here we're going to plug it in there And we'll just kind of push these toward the back and essentially the only thing that you have left to do for this build is plug in the molex connect okay guys so we hooked up the molex connections right here i did two off this strand and i did two off the other strand so you have two molex cables here i just i just split the power i mean these cards are probably not even going to pull close to wattage on this but you know we're just doing a little electrical safety i got cables so not a big deal so two on this side two on that side so the only things you really have left to do is you need to plug in your motherboard uh power here as well as your cpu power right here and then Plug in the GPUs and plug in the Molex and you are pretty much in the races. So that literally took like 10 minutes. That's how easy and fast this motherboard can be. It's extremely cost effective. It's cheap. It's easy to work with. Um, you don't have to build into anything. All right, guys, this is the Mining King giving you the most hashes and I'll see you next time.